Hi Mark, Jacqueline over at Steamboat Motors. Here's that video of our really cool new Bronco Sport. All right, so this one's the Outer Banks. Like I said, it is the Mac Daddy of all Broncos. Um, okay, so obviously upgraded lights, um, super LED, awesome. 18 inch wheels, all season, Michelin. Okay, I like it. You get your Outer Banks um, badging. I will point out the roof rails. That's super nice because not a lot of cars have that and you can add a Yakima, a Thule, or some kind of rack on there for extra storage space if you want. Um, I'll just go ahead and point out those wheels are awesome. Um, it does benefit um, the appearance, obviously. It's got those upgraded wheels, tires, whatever, um, and that Outer Banks. Um, here in the back, I will just go ahead and say that the cool thing about this is you can actually pop the glass um, or the whole door. So the glass does pop up. That's the first thing we've seen like that in a while. Um, we've got backup sensors here in the bumper, obviously backup camera. We'll open the door. Has a really cool um, back cargo area. So this is actually like all weather mat, okay? Um, which is really nice that Bronco even considered that for the rough and stuff, um, rough and tough stuff. And then we've got um, all weather mats as well, which is really nice. Um, here in the bottom, spare tire, love that. They started taking those out, so always look for that. We've got a couple plug-in outlets back here, a 12 volt, um, there's lights, all that kind of stuff. We'll pop into this inside. This is where it's going to get really nice and really cool really quick. All right, look at that. That's so pretty. Okay, so it's got a couple things going on in here, right? Um, we've got a black leather insert on the middle of the seat, okay? We've got a gray cloth on the exterior of the seat, and then on the very exterior is a brown leather, um, which is a it's a beautiful accent. I really like that a lot. Okay. Um, here in the back, cup holders do fold down. You will notice it has that um, light roof, which opens the car up substantially, which is nice. This is a cool thing. I told you Ford always thinks of the silliest, awesomest things. So this is actually your back pocket um, for your back seat on both driver and passenger. We do have AC plug-in outlet and USB in here in the back. Okay, couple vents, um, speakers, everything looks great. Um, just in case you lock yourself out um, or want to leave this at the airport, um, you've got that keyless entry. Um, first Bronco Sport ever with the 10 point electric seat. I love it. It has lumbar sport and it is the most comfortable seat configuration out there. All right. Um, we do have automatic lights and then um, access into the trunk if you wish. Okay, we'll go ahead and start her up. It does have keyless start. Okay, you got your cool Bronco here and there. Oh, we're out of fuel. We're gonna have to go get fuel. Um, so you got your cool embleming. That's gonna be all over the Bronco. I'll just go ahead and show you that seat. Um, Ford is proud and they have every right to be. All right, so from the driver's seat, Okay, everything's very accessible. We have cruise control on the left-hand side of the steering wheel, okay? And then on the right-hand side of the steering wheel, we have all the menu can options for the upper display um, as well as Bluetooth here, okay? Behind, you have front and back windshield wipers, okay? And then on the left-hand side on the back, you have easy access to your lane keeping assist and your lights, okay? All right, perfect, so we got that covered. Once you get into the center console display, there's a few things. You have half touchscreen, half manual buttons. We'll go over the touchscreen first. Um, in the home screen, which is on, um, we have Sirius XM, FM, and AM radio stations in your audio. You do have um, Bluetooth radio as well. We'll go ahead and go into that, so all your presets are here, and I'm sorry it's so hard to see because the little peely guy is still on there, but I don't like peeling it off yet. That's for you to do. Um, all of your settings are in here. You do have quite a few um, driver assist um, settings in this menu, which includes all the new safety features of lane keeping, pre-collision, um, and blind spot. Okay, 
super cool does have that automatic on off that's going to help um fuel efficiency wise okay um that's kind of a new fuel efficiency thing um you'll notice that brown accent right there i really like that there's a nice cubby here okay um in case you wanted to stash some stuff there when we get into your manual button the buttons this is going to be all of your um, controls for your climate um you will notice both passenger or driver and passenger have their own climate controls um, for temperature you do have heated seats on both driver and passenger and a heated steering wheel i always joke that the heated steering wheel is like a marriage you'll never go back from that but that is the truth um fan controls are here Okay, um, the cool thing about these newer cars, you can have defrost, feet, and face on. You do have a rear defrost um, for winter time up here if need be, which is kind of nice. Um, we'll get into this lower console display. You'll notice that right there is a wireless charging pad. Okay, so you can just throw your phone on there. That's super nice. There is a nice little display here that you can put your key fobs if need be. Um, USB and a 12 volt. All right, we're going to get into our shifter knob. This is the new shifter, okay? Um, so you've got your park, reverse, neutral, and drive, and a low mode, okay? So that's super nice. Um, this is a parking brake, and this is an automatic hold, um, which would just hold the brake for you at a stoplight, stop sign, or in a traffic jam. Um, we have goat modes, which are four-wheel drive modes. I'm going to go ahead and twist that. We're going to look up here, and we've got normal... And my camera zooms out really weird. I'm so sorry. Eco, sport, slippery, and sand. Okay. Um, so those are all your goat modes here, um, which is just going to be all your four-wheel drive settings. Okay. You have two cup holders here and a very nice center console display um, with another USB plug and outlet. Oh, and a little pin holder. I wish my car had that. Dang. All right, well, obviously, with it being brand new, everything is immaculate and beautiful and awesome, and I hope I didn't miss anything. If I did, please let me know. Oh, there's one thing I missed, b &O system, which means it, um, very nice, um, stereo system. All right, anyways, there's the Bronco Sport, okay? Um, like I said, uh, lift and tires can be added into that deal, um, if you wanted to proceed, uh, give me a call back, Jacqueline at Steamboat Motors, 970-778-2116. Thanks so much, Mark.